Hello darlings. So we're going to cover the Eiffel Tower, we're going to cover the Triple Goddesses, we're going to cover this war going on for the Saltis between the Equinox and this is why Paris, Texas, the film I covered the other day was so important because they show us Paris, Texas, North America, um, Mexico, uh, they show us the state, well, I showed you the Paris, Texas is in the shape of a scorpion. So this is Scorpio Rising. It was done by Kenneth Anger, the same man that did um, Lucifer Rising. And today Google celebrates the death of Romy Schneider, who played the role of Marianne. La Marianne. La Marianne is the female patron of, of France of the revolution, of the red cap, the little red riding hood with the cap, just like Marianne Faithful in Lucifer Rising. These are all films I've covered. I've done many videos about the triple goddesses. I started making videos in November 2018 uh, when Venus was retrograde in Virgo. And this is all from the eclipse of 2017. And we're at the bullseye. We're at that moment where they take liberty, fraternity, equality, uh, which is actually the summer golden triangle of Alter, Deneb and Vega, where Saturn, Pluto and Jupiter are right now retrograding. And they make them into their triple goddesses and they take Scorpio, ruled by Mars and make her into this red lady here in the middle. So we've got the old hag, the pre-sexual girl, Virgo, and the moon goddess, Diana, was killed in Paris and she becomes this um, red Kate Mars, Eris, that rides the bull. Okay, so here's Romy Schneider. Uh, Romy Schneider, so Rom, Rome, and Schneider, German. She was born in Austria. So this is exactly what's going on with the merging of, um, this is the red, white, and green Italian, Welsh uh, flag, and the yellow, black, and red German flag, which I'll be showing you on the Saltis, but... Um, this is, again, this is the uh, rising, Lucifer rising. This is that male uh, red air, Libra, and Mars, Scorpio, and they make Mars uh, into Eris riding the bull. I'll be showing you. But So she died today. She would have been 82 years old, years old. And she is very, very, very well loved in France. They go on and on and on about her. She is. Um, so. Jumping around a lot. But Lars of Alchemist Spiritual Chakra Astrology has got some great new pictures, which really helps to coincide with what I'm explaining. So here you see the um, German flag. Uh, and here is the Milky Way, and this is where we're at now. We're at this little passage here, and it's the fight for this Saltis. So Scorpio is ruled by Mars, and you know the Eiffel Tower is on the Champ de Mars. <clears throat> and Mars rules the uh, head with Aries. Here's Aries, yellow, fire, Asia. And Mars rules Scorpio, water, Europe, the sex organs. So they invert. They put Mars red at the top. And normally Scorpio becomes the eagle again. And it merges with Libra, red, masculine, air, ruled by Venus. So this is their merging. This is bringing up Moby Dick. Mars is in Pisces at the moment. And it is conjunct. Eris. So this is the beast. This is Scorpio Rising. This film by done by Kenneth Anger, the same person that did Lucifer Rising. So 
you've got Lucifer Libra rising and you've got Scorpio rising and this is the beast of the gap of this period of deception that we are going to be living so you've got the green man which they're putting in to make the white red green so it's a little bit like the second world war was to the first V for victory and the second V for victory now is Paris liberation um, this is why they had the Champ de Mars they had Charles de Gaulle which just means Wales and they got Prince Charles Wales so this Saltis should fall from England through Africa and they're shifting this Saltis so that it it's France Paris and it should that's why Paris Texas has got the Eiffel Tower in Paris Texas uh, the state from the film which is in the shape of a scorpion and uh, they, they're shifting it to the Eiffel Tower so the Eiffel Tower is also I'm going to be jumping around a lot. This is a friend of mine on YouTube, YouTube, who does incredible little five-minute videos. And he did this the other day, and I posted this a few days ago. Um, so let's just... Let's stop the music in case I have problems so Eiffel Tower energy harvester let's investigate so it's made of iron so Mars is iron and Venus is copper so uh, I'm going to be showing you there's the Eiffel Tower constellation as well above Virgo this is everything going on just had that we've got this month two black moons and a full moon in Pisces which is going to be the rising of this beast so um, you know I have covered in my old blog I did lots and lots about uh, the 11th arrondissement Aquarius in the orange district at Bataclan orange bats COVID bats um, I've, done, I've covered all that, I've covered Charlie Hebdo, um, I mean this has been coming to this for a long long time, I did my video the other day about Macron going to Condom, which is Capot, which is Capella, the tip of the Milky Way, the Milky Way is coming back, we've just had North-South Node enter Scorpio, uh, Scorpio, uh, Taurus Axis, so, uh, the, the, and it's the head of the climate change um, sustainable durability which is bringing in the fake hero the green man so this becomes red white and green the Italian and the Welsh Wales flag the Celts the Asterix so yeah they've got all the skulls in the underground catacombs of Paris Tour de France, one massive circuit, circle, energy, the yellow brick road. The yellow coats were begun as Uranus entered Aries. And so Aries ruled by Mars, Scorpio ruled by Mars is the top and the bottom of this Taurus field, which represents our spine. This is the new crocodile, Momo, the giant crocodile. Uh, Momo is Amit, the, you know, the keeper, the devourer of the dead. Okay, so this, today there has been a bomb scare in Paris. So this is the beginning, this is the preparation. So he's going to show he'll show you that Taurus field. Um, you can come and see his videos. Armageddon Consciousness. Very clever, short little videos which are incredibly intelligent. His work. So I've just got so much 
to explain, but you can come and see this. And I have to be very delicate. MJ, Michael Jackson, Mercury, Jupiter, Skull and Bone Cross. This is the film Scorpio Rising, made in 1964. This is why G7 was in 2019 exactly as the sun was uh, all the planets were in leo we're now leaving leo for virgo so this film by kenneth uh by kenneth anger who did lucifer rising so we've got scorpio and libra coming up to the top of the saltis and this is Mars and Venus, so they create Eris. Mars is conjunct Eris right now. So um, this is the Chiron. Chiron was discovered in 1977. And Chiron, so this is very disturbing. Masks, Hell's Angels, uh, the, the Resurrection, Jesus. This is the Resurrection now that we're living Scorpio rising becomes the eagle, and Altair, Deneb, and Vega are their liberty, equality, and fraternity, bringing in the green um, echo. You know, don't, if you hear an echo, don't turn back. Keep coming out of the cave in mythology. There's Jesus on the donkey, the ass. And we've got the red. Right, so I haven't seen this film, but I just thought of it. So, 64 is the Department of Biarritz, which looks out onto the Atlantic with the Virgin Mary on the rocks. Picnic at Hanging Rock. Uh, and Picnic at Hanging Rock. I've got here as well, and I've covered this film very much. So, incredible, the new things that I saw looking through because I did my videos about the triple goddesses. I've done many videos using Picnic at Hanging Rock. So today in Victoria, a 14-year-old boy goes missing, killed. This is the film in Picnic at Hanging Rock. They show the P and the Q. The P and the Q, if they don't use it like this, with all that Q movement, is a Q, which is just an upside-down P, which is the same as... The Eiffel Tower constellation. So here's the Eiffel Tower, and you see we've got this flag. This is the Liberty Pole with the Fez cap on the top, and this is Jaws. So this is bringing up the beast from Pisces, Mars in Pisces, um, and this is the upside down Chiron. You see Chiron, so here's Chiron, and the Cairo, which I've explained, I did my video, I'm trying to explain, it. everything is happening so quickly, and I would quite honestly rather just completely cut off from all this, because it's, but um, we have a duty to explain what's going on so as you can see my computer is completely overloaded with stuff open but I'm trying to show you so the Cairo we've got uh, the two sides we've got the two the block of the top and the bottom of the saltus is what they're doing now and this will become the Romulus and the Remus the K that's why Chiron is CH but it's pronounced K and they want to this is the peg in the skull and bone to crucify the fixed signs in the mutable gaps, which is what they're doing uh, right now. So this Eiffel Tower represents this P in the middle. And Eiffel Tower cluster. Yep, it's been almost impossible filling up, getting everything. Okay. 
this is the risk with having so much open that the whole complete computer will just close down so here so this is very much the squaring of the circle here's the Eiffel Tower um, right here and this is on Stellarium it's just above Ursa Major which is exactly where the Sun is right now here's the Sun and this okay so it's somewhere around here but they don't show it is it that there so on the tip of the dragon this But it says 1310. Anyway, I I found it. Um, 1310. It's on 1310. So it could be this little triangle here. Okay, so we've got this Cairo, which is the flag, which is the Liberty Pole, uh, which is the bringing in this is why for the yellow coats they had the five um because they're making it into the five pointed star they're taking over from taurus venus using libra venus at the top with scorpio mars and at the bottom taurus and aries and uh, that's black and yellow that they merge with white um which which they merge with uh, so it's, it's the German flag and the Italian flag basically um, so again today is the September the 23rd this is mainstream astrology the day that the Virgo becomes Libra so black air becomes red air but as we know the Sun is well and truly still in Virgo so this is making uh, Libra taking over the black, again, the black energy of the uh, Virgo girl. And here we have Victoria again, a 14-year-old. So this is the Virgo girl, pre-sexual. And this is Gemini, the little boy, eight-year-old twins, Romulus and Remus. Uh, this is, these are rituals to kill her. This is Australia, Virgo, with New Zealand. So they're taking the boy, the teenager boy, and making masculine this Virgo girl. So this brings us back. This is in Victoria. This is, we're coming up to um, Halloween. We're coming up to, um, this is exactly nine months, the journey of Venus after um from valentine's day nine months later the baby is born and so we are they are literally birthing their antichrist i've done so many videos about this so he's called william wall so this is the ww this is the mm it's the same thing it's the milky way will i am this is uh, the merging of Aries and Taurus at the bottom. I will, I am. Um, so I haven't really looked into that. Somebody sent that to me this morning, but uh, bullshit. One man said the decision was bullshit. So yeah, we're, we're at the bull, the Taurus. Okay. So um, I'll show you Picnic at Hanging Rock again, Game of Thrones, Picnic at Hanging Rock. So this triangle is the summer triangle. So you have the Triangle Doré in the middle of Paris where I used to live. And I woke up when I had my Vicky Vibes heart pumping and Princess Diana was killed at Pont Alma, which is the old, um, you know, which is, which they, the, she was the middle, the, she was the Taurus, the moon goddess, Diana, 
So you see this triangle they show, this is the squaring of the circle of Taurus. This is Libra, the five pointed stars. So they've had the five passages. Um, and you see, so they've got the Alpha Omega AB, Taurus Libra, and they've got the two sides of the Saltis now. Uh, the P and the Q, which is just the Chiron. They put the Q in capital, they put the P in baby, but that capital is a Q as an upside down P, and it's got that little tail, the tail of the Scorpio. So let's just have a look at this film, and let me just show you the bit where you've got the three goddesses that make it through the Vesica Pieces. So they always show you the three pillars and there's three that go missing. Don't forget that here this is the famous scene where they show you the lizard, uh, which is the Salaman, which I've explained we're going through when we did the Solomon Gates. Um, there was the Salaman on her arm. Brenda, I feel awful. Really awful. There. Really awful. Oh, it's just there. Uh, Miranda, I feel perfectly awful. Sal so this is Bin Salman, Salman of Saudi Arabia. There. And where I live here, you have the nine forests of Look. Salman. So the three pillars, the rock, and here is the famous shot of the Salman. So this is where my dog went missing at the rocks, the crystal rocks of Salman. Uh, you get all this in all my videos. And he was lost for one night, and that was some kind of thing we were doing to open the gates. It's called Salamani, it's feminine, and they've made the Prince Bin Salman. So then she sees the triangle, she looks up, and they want to make their saltis the peak, the summer triangle of Altair. So they come back to the solar pillar, because the lunar pillar is why Macron went to Condom, which is Capot, Capella, which is the end of the lunar of the Milky Way. So... Um, you see here right so let's just get rid let me just show you these triple goddesses here now let's get rid of this and i show you what we've got at the moment so we've had this month so today is the official mainstream they say the 23rd that the sun is going into libra and Libra and Scorpio are going to become the new Saltis. So we've got the green man, we've got the gap here, and we've got the moon, which is right on this gap uh, today. It was on the hero. This is their fake hero. And so I'll show you the three phases. This is very rare. And when I started my videos, we also had a double black moon in Virgo. And uh, that was when uh, my son opened the Russian play at the Tabernacle in London uh, that November 2018 as Venus was retrograding. Venus, ruler of Libra, was retrograding in Virgo 40 days and 40 nights. And I think that Venus was just on spicker on her way back when my son did the play The Death of the Girl at the Tabernacle in London. And my videos... I began at that time, so you can always go back. Okay, sorry, but see, normally when I do readings, I have a completely clear computer. But today I've had to open a lot. Okay, so let's have a look at this month. Let's get the, let's tag the moon so we can see. So she's doing a full 
So we had on the 17th, we have a black moon in Virgo and mainstream had a black moon in Virgo here. Then we've got on the 10th, which has been hailed as a massive clampdown of Australia coming up, martial law. The 10th of the 1st, we've got a full moon on the beast here. And I'm not absolutely sure of the time. That moon, maybe it's more on the... So it's joining Mars and Eris and Chiron are over here. And I think that Chiron, so it's going to be right on Chiron, that moon for the full moon. And the Mars is conjunct to Eris. So, um, yeah, this is the incredible patience I need. Sorry. So let's put Eris. Eris, right, so here's Mars right now on Eris, this is exactly what they want, they want to bring up Scorpio, Pisces and Cancer, all represent water and they are bringing up this beast, this is the last gap before we move on to Aquarius Capricorn on the west way and this is bringing up the beast which is going to be the pink panther the pink flamingo this is the pink between white europe and red air here so this is why this is where this is normally mexico this is north america that's why paris texas uh, that film was a german and french production and uh what was the other film i saw um, the other day, German-French production as well. Um, I can't remember everything to tell you. So let's carry on with this. The 10th of the 1st, we've got this full moon opposition here. And then we're going to have, again, another black moon. Here, on the 16th. So And that is going to be right on Spicker. So this is where Mercury is right now, Mercury in exaltation. So this is the boy in uh, Australia. Virgo is Australia. He was killed, 14 years old, autistic, like Greta Pippi Longstocking. Greca, Greta Pippi Longstocking, they don't want the Pluto in Virgo generation to become the creators of the new Earth now. They're jumping to the Pippa. Pippa even to the Pluto and Scorpio generation. You see, um, one day I'll sit down and just do videos about astrology, but the pendulums of the sky, Pluto is going to be ending his journey from the French Revolution, 1776 American Revolution. French Revolution was the journey of Pluto's 244 years. And the children who are going to be born, uh, we've got... Um, Neptune, which is going to enter Pisces, so into that last leg, that last door out, it's going to be a time of complete um, illusion, delusion. Yes, this is something very important I must show you. And so, Jackson, Michael Jackson, this is the Chiron, the triumph, okay? This is the Chiron, uh, the Cairo. The Cairo is the MJ, Mercury and Jupiter, skull and bone cross, the mutable ages, the P, the sword and the stone. Uh, so here's the Michael Jackson, and they're going to announce the five-pointed star. Um, so this is Eris, this is Scorpio and Libra, and Mars rules Scorpio. She becomes Eris on the bull, the heart. The spot marks this is the touche this is where we are now we're at that middle point between the two eclipses 2017 and 2024 it's the midpoint where they take over the bullseye and i'm saying that's going to be on 322 uh, march the 22nd 
Mars will be on that bullseye there. So this is the first part of the ritual of this marking of the Touche, the Four Musketeers, the town of Condom, where Macron went, old Ronald MacDonald, last trumpet, Macron, uh, Ronald MacDonald, Ronald signed the Noahide Law, Martial Law. So this is the beginning of the chaos. Eiffel Tower is representing the Taurus field. The, it's an energy harvesting machine. Um, okay, so this is Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. So we've got the two sides. It's 1977, Chiron was found. He was in Sagittarius. And now he's in Pisces. Altair is 77, whatever, miles away. 1977 was the film Lucifer Rising. Uh, yeah, 1977 are the two triangles, front to back, the 7-7, seven, seven. Um, it's the 007, so uh, when I started making videos, it was on the 07, that first black moon in Virgo or something, you have to go back and see the videos, so Game of Thrones, no, William Mel, no, the Jacksons, can you feel it, okay, so look here. So yeah, I was talking about Neptune is going to go into Pisces. And so we're not really out the 12th door until Pluto is going, he's entering Capricorn now. Then he'll do 20 years in Aquarius and then he'll move into Pisces. And that's when the subconscious will at last. Scorpio, the desert, they want to make everything barren, aldebaran, sterile to sterile earth and they're selling you the green man we've even got a Scorpio so now where is I think they've taken it away this video look they show everything in this video get yeah, I use it in all my readings to explain Pisces to people um, Here's the Eiffel Tower again. Um, I was just going to show you the map of that's the German flag. The Summer Triangle. This is um, okay. The Eiffel Tower. Okay, so maybe right the German flag. Let's just have a map. Eiffel Tower and you'll see that the Eiffel Tower sits between the 7th arrondissement and the 16th which is 7-7 seven, seven again so Eiffel Tower there's war planes going over up Eiffel Tower map did have one open. Yeah, it blocks. I can't even pause the video because this is the problem. Having so much to say to you means so. Give me a map, please. Map. Right, so you've got the Champ de Mars, you've got the Pont d'Ina, so this is Inanna, this is this is the Weaver, this is Eris, this is okay, so right. Okay, Champ de Mars, and they give you the arrondissement, so 7th and 16th, 7th, 7, 7th, 7, 77. Um, we've got l'étoile, the Arc, Arc de Triomphe. So, Palais Tokyo, of course, Asia. 
that's why the darts, the bullseye dart, the men from my little village went to Tokyo two years ago, world championships, darts, ele electronic darts in Tokyo, Pale Tokyo, because it's the moving over. Um, all, you know, Europe is just a slave trade. It's been sold. We've been sold out. All the, they're, they're all the, um, they've been sold out. So uh, there was a lot more that I saw, but 7-7 seven, seven as we're there. So let's go back. What was I taking you to before? Um, to make obscure unclear, to obfuscate a problem with extent extenuous information, deceived to mislead by deliberate misinterpretation or lies, in vague look to lure by false representations or, or other deceit. So this is the three words that open the Michael Jackson video that I have done in old videos as well. Uh, this is Pisces. This is Mars in Pisces. This is the age we leave. So we're going to have the children, we're going to have Neptune moving in 2022, or is it 2023? I've done that in a video. Uh, but this is why they made the Peter Pan 50p, um, because we're going into this uh, complete, uh, utopic uh, peace, love, light. This is the Libra peace, this is the pigeon. Again, that pigeon, Libra, the white dove. Uh, which is actually Mercury, pigeons are Mercury, uh, that white dove, it's the trickster. So coming back to the Jackson, so they, I can't find the video where they open it up with that, but everything is in this little video. Carry on, little video. Right. Not easy for the train of thought when everything is so slow either. Okay, I've cut the sounds, the pillars. Yeah. Yeah, it's, I'm sorry. Wow, well, it's all in there. So let's just go back to um, the pictures of of uh, Lars, because I can explain it a lot better. Facebook. Come along, Facebook, right. So, um, the third temple of the true royalties are all mankind. Well, see, so here we've got Eris. This is the gap. This is their coming. We're at this gap now. That they, so let's show you. He's got lots of new pictures, too. This is the sigil. So this is... That, you know, this is we're coming back to the age of Saturn, the true, but they turned this into Lucifer's uh, sigil. Um, we're coming back to this, we're coming out of the contraction, uh, the expansion to the contraction, right? So, um these are all brilliant, but I don't want to confuse you. So you see we're here, we're at this gap here. This is the fake green hero, the fake 13th sign. They're making the pink panther between white and reds. And they're making this grey between the yellow and black and the green here. So uh, basically to keep their solar lunar pillar going... Okay, come on. All 
Lars's pictures always because, um, but this picture helps me the best to explain. So we're, we're at this gap here and um, this, this is the crowning of their Taurus. And the other picture, this one is the most useful for me. So we've got the two V for victories and we're at this gap now. So just coming, we've got the north-south node, which represent the Milky Way at these exact gaps just at the moment. The head coming into Taurus, the feet coming into Scorpio. So um, this also represents the chakra system. This is the Saltis, this is the Eiffel Tower, the Taurus middle. And so putting Scorpio at the top, that's Scorpio and Libra, they come to the top. So Scorpio ruled by Mars, Libra ruled by Venus. They make Eris from this beast coming out of the sea here, where Mars is right now. And at the bottom, we're going to have Taurus and Aries. And Mars, again, takes over from Venus. So we've now got the head at the bottom, sexual organ, Scorpio at the top, upside down, Antichrist. Uh, this is the new equinox. This is the spring autumn equinox. And that is the true new rising king, is Saturn. It's not their Lucifer rising Libra. It's not their Scorpio rising um, Mars. Uh, uh, this is Mars and Venus. It's Saturn that takes over here. Aquarius and Capricorn. So, King Rock, you have the three girls that disappear. These are the original, these are the Virgo, these are the Virgin Suicides. This is Australia, she's even got a little butterfly on here. Um, and you have one of the girls that comes back. Yeah. This is very important. So here she comes, all dressed in red. This is the middle girl. This is Taurus that they make into Mars, the red cape, La Marianne. Go and look up what the La Marianne is. It's the female figure of equality, fraternity, and liberty. So this is Kali, destruction. They merge. The triple goddess, that makes all the arms of Kali, Shiva. And so she comes back and none of the girls recognize her and they start beating her up. They want to know where she was gone, why she wasn't there. But she's gone from, she's no longer a virgin. She's no longer a virgin girl like them. She's become the whore of Babylon. So this is what they've got for Europe. This is the woman. This is the woman in the Michael Jackson video. This is the Statue of Liberty. This is the Liberty Pole taking over from Taurus, the Maypole. So Cancer, Cali, Destruction, the original Saltis with Capricorn. And uh, this is... This is them going crazy. This is an intruder. This is an imposter. This is not their girl. This is what they've created. This is masculine Venus, Libra, Eris, and we've got Mars conjunct right now. So it's very important to understand. We've right now got um, Eris and Chiron in Pisces. They were found in 1977. Uh, it takes 49 years to go around. Uh, they've always, he's always been there, but they only gave us the um, knowing of Chiron in his last journey round the wheel. So you've got the two bars as well, and they met in the middle. There's so much in this film. There's all that bit, that funny bit where he goes to Egypt. Oh, and of course, this is the French. The French mistress, you see, if I show you, um, 
They've created two different women, completely different women, the Fr French woman and the English woman, the English rose and the whore of Babylon, the French woman. So they've created this image. They've got a series in France called the Connasse, which means, you know, she's a really rude, horrible, horrible woman. And I, I, I've noticed there are it's more and more Parisian for the young girls to really behave in a very opposite way to the English. So it's the two sides of the female of the Mary. There was a little girl who had a little curl. When she was good, she was very, very good. And when she was horrid, she was horrid. So they keep us separated from the middle ground. And the French will bring up this uh, feminist. That's why they had Simone Weil in France. But like in Paris, Texas, it's all that connection with the French stepmother, who's really lovely. And... This French woman here, and the girls all love her. This is the last, this last scene with the English. So this is the old hag, uh, the Capricorn woman, and the French woman. I guess this is that, the girl who killed herself. So Romy Schneider, uh, her son died at 14 years old as well, just like this boy in Australia today, 14 years old. 14 is the virgin pre-sexual girl. And they we've got the two boys. We've got the boy in Australia and we've got Romy Schreider's son, uh, Romulus and Remus, Gemini. Gemini, because if you see these pictures of Lars... Well, as I opened up my page, let's just finish these pictures of the Triple Goddess. So we've got this month, the waxing and waning crescent moon. That's why in France we eat croissant. We eat croissant because this is the bull. You put that in half, put a line in the middle, you've got the two tusks of the bull. So the bully is being made. And it's being made in Virgo. So these are the triple goddesses, but look, that's Kali. It's the one, it's they take the middle woman and use her. It's going to be the new Saltis, Taurus. And they use her as the new cancer destruction, Kali. Uh, she was uh, brought up and worshipped in the age of Gemini, Kali, because it was after the destruction. And there you see it's a picture of a friend of mine. She did that, so you can see that tusk. That was two nights ago. That was the 21st. It was on the spring equinox. There she is, Virgo, with the Gemini symbol being put above her. The little boy. And these are the ostrich feathers, the three fleurs de lys, the triple goddesses. And there's Mars on those two tusks of the Taurus. Mars takes over at the bottom, Aries, yellow, Mars, takes over black, Taurus, and at the top, Scorpio, white, um, Mars, takes over um, Venus, uh, Venus, air, Libra, and becomes Eris, Eris, the woman who rides the bull. So there again, the three-headed monster dog, the triple goddess, Cerebus, and this is the moon star. The phone number of NHS is just the three corners. It's the 111777. The triangle of 77 makes three angles. The three angles, the VVVLLL, -L -L, the moon star, moon star. Okay, full moon in Pisces brings up. The monster. So in these, um, this is about the Eiffel Tower cluster, and the constellation of Virgo is known as Jaws. Okay, so not that one. I have to be very slow. So it's between Mizar and Alcohol. That's what I found. That's what I found. Okay. There's the Eiffel Tower. Okay. So if you look, Nuit Blanche in Paris, you see in White Night, this is 
the Eiffel Tower constellation. No, that's the Summer Triangle. Here we go. So the Summer Triangle is where we've got the three big boys, Pluto, Saturn, and Jupiter, retrograde. But we've got, oh yes, between these we've got the 29th Saturn going forward, and Jupiter has just gone forward. I'm not sure of the date again. I think um, Lavette just did a video showing Jupiter go forward. I have found the dates in past videos. Okay, come on, darlings, please. Okay, that only took about an hour to open, so good thing I paused the video. So again, I've spoken a lot about this. This is Deneb, this is the tip of the horseshoe. If you look at the Milky Way in a circle, it makes a horseshoe. You've got Capelle here, Deneb here. And this is where the big boys are now, under Altair. This is this gap. This is the gap in the Milky Way. Um, and, oh. So, let me show you. If I was able to open quickly, I would take, if you open Altair in Wikipedia, you look through it, you'll see that it's 77 something uh, miles, it's a 77, it's the VV, it's the um, the Vulcan, the Vulcan Vulture or something, it's got, so, the wall, Nebula and the Sinius wall, this is the swan, picnic in Hanging Rock, always showing the swan, and Diana buried with the four black swans. Um, so this ring nebula. Oh, I would just like to whiz down. So there's just at the bottom. So here again, this is Jaws. So this is oh, Jules Asterium in Virgo. So this is the flag. This is the upside down P. Here are some of the most widely known Asteriums in the night sky. The Big Dipper. And we've got Orion Sword and the Eiffel Tower and Napoleon's Hats. Okay. Okay, uh, another 20 minutes later, <laughs> I just tried to open the article I had open about the bomb threat. But look, one, two, three, four, five. We've got the five-pointed Venus Rummy. Oh, here we go. Are they actually going to take me to the page? This is why if you see me on Facebook, I'm on Facebook because that's all I can do. I get on my phone for these hours I'm made to wait. Oh no, I mean, this whole video has been just, it's impossible. Okay, they do, I mean, it only happens to me when I really have to do something important, like make a quick video. But again, I have had the computer open all day, and so look, it's even taken away Romy from me. Okay, I'm going to pause again. Oh to get something. So there she is again, that uh, heiress, Marianne, La Marianne. You have to go look all this up. You look at my old videos. I've been building up to this for a long time. Um, Eiffel Tower bomb. Uh, you're just being silly now. This is just silly. This is just so on. But oh, it that took a very very long time to open so again we've got the four corners and the fifth the fifth republic 5g fifth element fifth wave that film the fifth wave is exactly the illusion that scene where uh 
they wear the children, they use the children, they use the children, they take the parents away. If you go and see all the films of Romy Schneider, she was in the film The Swimming Pool, La Piscine, uh, and she was in um, The Train. So that's why I told you they've opened up the Midnight Train, the Midnight Express, and the clock stops at Picnic at Hanging Rock at midday. So again, it's like Midnight Express. It's always about the Salters. Okay, it's going to ask me to take three hours to wind to go down. But I can... Oh, what a cinema. So all that, half an hour later, I just wanted to open the one I had, and there was another 77 used. So I can't go back to show you because... You can see it just takes half an hour to open up one article. Right. So you get, we've got the triple goddess, this this uh, Virgo. We've got um, Halloween coming up. I haven't looked at what the planets are doing. We're going to have Deadly Valentine. I've been through in my old, my old Victoria Cotton WordPress. Mary Magdalene, loads of very big, heavy articles that I used to write before I did videos. Um, and I explained so much uh, back stuff, uh, foundations to everything I talk about. Right, this is just it rolling. Can, you, can I just at least show the article? No. Okay, can I scroll? This, I never ever have this bad. Uh, this is when I tried to make a video. Incredible. It's completely blocked again. Okay, well, this is this. Look at this. So my computer is moving again. I've managed to close pages. Took so long. So let's just recap. Um, so we've got the triple goddesses, which I'm going to open now, but I'm just recapping before I open. So we've got um, this Saltis line. This is their last V for victory. It's their liberation that they're bringing in now. Just in French newspapers in a little village near here, Saint Martin. So Saint Martin de Tours is uh, the free Martin. It's creating from the bull the twins. So the twins is rising up. Uh, the sign of Gemini above the high priestess. So they're able to do this ritual this month because of the three phases. We've got a full eight phases of the moon, two black moons, a full moon in Pisces. So that's the last mutable gap with Mars and Eris and Chiron finishing his journey. So that's the P in the Q that we saw in uh, Picnic at Hanging Rock, the triangle. So they make Jupiter, Pluto, Saturn on top of Altair, Vega, and D, um, uh, Deneb, which is the, uh, the solar pillar side of the closing of the Milky Way. The solar pillar began with Sagittarius, Chiron, the Senator, uh, and now it closes. So Gemini, the Free Martins, they're masculizing, sterilizing, making barren, the Earth axis, the female axis will all go barren, life on Mars. Um, you know, this is the Sodom and Gomorrah, this is the pedophili, this is the Peter Pan, this is keeping the two eight-year-old boys, Romy Schneider, today seen as five parts of the woman in red, uh, Eris, Libra, Mars, Venus, uh, so um, Mars taking over Scorpio. We've had Kenneth Anger that had Scorpio and Lucifer Rising, two films he made, uh, one in 1964, the year that G7 is at Biarritz. The flag of Biarritz is red and black. They knew that it was normally the end of the Holy Grail, that we go over to North America, South America, uh, and now they use the Basque flag, red, green, and white. So red and white making the green man, and the green man comes between the black and yellow Capricorn Jupiter. Um, uh, this is the German flag with uh, this red Eris, the rising of Eris. So 
This is the twins, Gemini, uh, becoming the free Martin bully. Uh, Mercury is in exaltation on Spicker today. Uh, this is the child. So we're going to have Deadly Valentine in February the 14th, which is the festival of Lupercalia, the fertility festival, Taurus, and of Romulus and Remus. And we've had, I've spoken a lot, Charlotte Gansbrough did that song Deadly Valentine. She has an album called Reset, the daughter of Jane Birkin and uh, Serge Gainsbourg again, uh, Melody Nelson, y Mellow Yellow. Um, this is the Scorpio White, um, Scorpio White Europe merging with Yellow Asia um, with um, Sagittarius, Mellow Yellow. So the triple goddess is originally it's Virgo, Taurus, and um, Virgo, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. So you've got the young girl, the mother, and the hag. These are the three stages of all women. All women are first of all that very ripe sexual girl. Now, it's not going to make me wait hours to open this too. Okay, so, and then you, but now you've got the, um, this summer triangle, the saltus, the summer, trying to make it into the liberty pole. The liberty pole is the, taking over from the maypole, the Taurus. And this is why when I was looking at um, the all night Paris Eiffel Tower, they have all the Swedish and all the German, Swedish, the Greta Pippi Longstocking, Midsummer Night's Dream. Uh, they're creating the, 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 the Liberty Pole. And this is all the eco, sustainable durability, the Paris Climate Change Conference. Uh, so we've got... So here's the triple. This is what we've got in Virgo this month. And it's the crescent, it's the croissant in French. Crescent is croissants, we eat the croissant, it's the liberty. Uh, the triple goddess is a deity or deity archetype revered in many neo-pagan religions and spiritual traditions. In common neo-pagan usage, the triple goddess is viewed as a trinity of three distinct aspects or figures united in one being. This is liberty, fraternity and equality. This is hope, faith and charity. This is the trip. L, the three L's, which make the one, one, one of NHS, of Moonster Monster Drink. They're bringing up the beast of the sea. So Scorpio is also water, and this is to keep cancer, Kali, destruction. Those three goddesses together make those arms of the one come together. So, so the horned gods brings from the underworld, so this is what we're bringing up, each of which symbolizes both a separate stage in the feminine life cycle and a phase of the moon, and often rules the moon, rules cancer, and often rules one of the realms of heaven, earth, and the underworld. So the moon rules cancer, but it's an exaltation in Taurus. Um, so, you know, you read that, I've done all my, you, you go and read that. So this is that fake feminism that they brought up, the whole Me Too, to get her. So between Diane and Hecat, this is Taurus and Capricorn. Capricorn is where we're going, North America. North America, they turn into life on Mars. Okay, so it's blocking for me again. Um, let's see if we can go to Stellarium. That took me a very long time as well. So here we've now got, as I speak, the Sun and Mercury all on speaker. So, and we've got, um, yeah, it's going to make me, come on. Oh, no. Moving again, so um, it had just stopped for another long time. There's Deneb on the swan. There's Deneb. Are they going to let me move it? Here's Deneb. So we've got these tips 
of the Milky Way and at the top we've got Capella, Capella and I showed you in the last video um, the horseshoe but I'm not sure if I, I, I want to finish without losing my focus. I started this video, I can't believe this, I started this video at 7, it's now 11, um, it's only an hour long, but this is how much, how difficult that was, but it had to come out, so it's just so important, and I can't keep my thought together with this, this is just impossible. I will get there, darlings, I will get new computers, I will get everything together, I will get it all will all come together so we've got Venus on um, we've got Venus on the lion no, no this is 1010 this is 1010 okay this is not now let's go back to now oh please please just let me finish Okay, 9.23, this big date, we're officially on the um, going, the, the official astrology has us going into Libra, so this is how they're using, making these three goddesses into that Libra, um, Venus, Lucifer, um, that you see, this is taking over, this is the sigil uh, of Saturn, they use that V for victory, that sigil, that V of the contraction of um, of the Capricorn. They, this is the Baphomet. They, so this is not the Baphomet. They use Mars in Scorpio, Libra as the Baphomet, and they make him the top at the Saltis when the gateway, the ascendant, is the west way. Twin Peaks, Aquarius, red air and um so north america and south america uh, black earth we're coming on to this mexico paris texas uh we're in that gap we're in that gap very much like baghdad cafe where she's got her mj bag between uh germany and africa okay so this is right now we've got mercury on spicker the sun will be on spicker for that full moon on the 10th um, and we've got here under Altair this is the triangle Deneb, Vega, Altair this is the their summer triangle which is opposite Sirius which is the Champ de Mars this is their this is their coming up the Milky Way the Champ de Mars so they are trying to use this axis this is their V this is bringing in the green their jolly green Italian Welsh flag, red, white, and green. Um, so red air Libra, white Scorpio, and green, the green man. And then we've got the black and yellow of Sagittarius trying to merge with Capricorn, and red air here trying to take over. So Germany trying to take over the equinox, and... Um, here we've got the Italian flag, the green man taking over this gap, V for victory. So they're using now the triple goddess phase uh, to create this uh, Diana moon goddess, which is uh, just Eris, Libra, uh, from taking from Taurus and um, Taurus and Aries at the bottom, the black and yellow B. Uh, and making this um, Eiffel Tower, fake Taurus, Liberty Pole, uh, as the Chiron closes from the journey of the Senator, where you get all the story of the Senator uh, with, uh, it might, it, it's not going to open, so I'm not going to, I'm going to stop the video here. Okay, darlings, you can join all that up, you're very clever. Uh, yeah, we won't even try. I love you very much, bye.